Caught in the Act on Fox Carolina is sponsored by IHC Security. Your peace of mind is our top priority. Welcome back. Tonight, we're starting a new segment called Caught in the Act. We'll feature things caught on camera that are making headlines, and we'll start right here. Yeah, starting in the upstate, where Greer police need your help to find this man. Officers say he stole more than $1,600 in perfume from Ulta on Wade Hampton Boulevard. Police believe he left in a black Toyota Camry with a license plate covered up with paper. If you have any information on this case, if you know who this is, call Greer PD. A lot of bizarre moments were also caught on camera across the country this week, and here's a look at just a few. We are starting in New Mexico, where police say a drunk 12-year-old girl took a joy ride with her family's car, taking officers on a chase down the highway. This is a look at Alamo Gordo officers arresting her and three of her friends in that car. Police say the car sped past them while they were responding to another case. That led up to an hour-long chase, which ended after police say the preteen lost control in a dirt lot. Officers say all four girls had been drinking, and they're now facing charges. Now to Oklahoma City, two window washers got the ride of their lives this morning. Look at this video. The basket started swinging wildly out of control. It was right there at Devon Tower. The workers, as you can imagine, hanging on for dear life as it just started to swing around the building, shattered some glass there as well. It happened for about 45 minutes until firefighters could get them down safely. Both men are going to be okay. According to the website there, the tower is 844 feet high. In Washington, D.C., the White House got some unexpected visitors on Monday. A mother duck and her ducklings spotted waddling toward the White House before going under the barrier and walking right across the front lawn.